Welcome to Blue Sharp Five Nights channel. Uh, my friend Hood's got a big cookout today for a wedding. He's got his uh, barbecue trailer. And now uh, you guys just watch the video. You'll like what you see. All right. So keep watching. What you got the fire going there, Hoot? Yep. Get her started up for the wedding. Let's take a look in there. Look at that. Ooh, look at the fire going. He's heating it up. Get her started up for the wedding. Get the coals down. Bring my temperature down to smoke, and, uh, and then we'll be putting on some smoke chips and all the first we'll start with the pork shoulders, and then probably about one o'clock I'll start with the chicken. There you go. So we're putting the meat inside here now. Yep. Wow, look at that, you guys! You can fill all this up right here. Yep. And how long are you gonna cook these for? It'll be about eight hours. Eight hours of slow cooking, huh? Yeah, seven, wow. eight. You got room on the other side too? Yep. Wow, that's cool. So how many of these can you get? How many trays can you get in here? Well, I can go two rows, so. Oh, that's nice. I got five. You really don't want to get real close to the center. Don't stay away from the fire, huh? Well, it gets hot. Does it? Yep. Yeah. So what I gotta do is watch them shuffle. There's another one behind you. Okay. Right? Yeah. There's some more right here too. Yeah. All right. All ready to shut it. Starts cooking it, huh? Yep. That's a total of ten altogether. Ten trays of meat in there, huh? Yep. What are you cooking by chance? That's pork shoulder. Oh, pork shoulder. Oh, okay, cool. Pork shoulder and two pork butts, I think. Okay, cool. Yeah, who, what's in there? This here, I've got cherry and uh, yeah, pecan wood. That's going to go on. Uh, That's going to be the, mo the smoke for the meat. Oh, cool. Cherry. So you put that right over the charcoal then, or what? No, I lay it on each side of the burner. Oh, Once okay. that gets down. Yep. The door open, uh, that's going to control the heat, right? Yeah. Okay. That kind of can help control the heat and bring down the temperature. That's cool. Or bring it up. Two right there. I'm just adjusting the, the stacks and that helps control the heat. The amount of smoke and heat comes out. Oh, okay. Stacks up. You got, you got three of them, huh? Three yeah. stacks on there. Okay. I shut off the middle so the heat goes out both ends. Cool. Flame at. What do you, what do you try to keep the flame at? All right. How hot? How hot? So you were adjusting the stacks there for well, a second? Well, it's say 300 right now and I'm bring it down. We just put the meat in. The meat's real cold. Yeah. So it'll, you know, take a while for that to get hot. And then I'm going to drop it down to 250 and then try to hold it there with the smoke. That in there, you got the smoke chips in there? Yep. Oh, yeah. See that, you guys? Pecan cherry. Yes. What kind of smoke chips are them? Pecan cherry. Oh, yeah. Are you going to check them? Yeah, I'm going to check them. It's been a four-hour smoke. There they are. Ooh, look okay. at that. Nice. Yeah, they're looking good. See a fire down below? Yeah. Another eight hours, another four hours, so a total of eight hours of cooking. Yeah, yeah. All right. And then he's going to put some chicken on later, too? Yeah, chicken will go on at one. Okay, cool. I'm hoping. What he's doing now is he's cooling down, uh, keeping the heat, keeping the temperature consistent, right? All right, go ahead. There you go. Up once. Oh, yeah. Some more fire in there. There you go. All right, dropper. I think you don't need any more charcoal in there. No, don't take that up. Got the baffles right here that controls the air, air and uh, fire. Got three baffles right there. Oh, you you do this thing with wood. You, I know we cook with wood, but I see you got a propane tank. What's that for? Well, that's for I use that to keep the barbecue hot. Oh, okay. So that's like well, a backup. You keep it. You can cook with it. Actually, oh, you can. But, but yeah. you just do it to keep the warmth. Instead. Well, you can cook with it. Oh, you so can. Actually, yeah. if you smoke for two hours, huh. you can put the burners on and then just finish your 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 product up. Well, okay. pork's coming out. Look at there, you guys. You oh, you can't believe how the smell. These smell so good. Yum. Look at that. Yum, yum, yum. And he's checking the temperature. Make sure everything's 100 percent. There you go. Temperature's right. We probed them. Now he's going to foil them and we're going to put them on, uh, keep them hot so they serve them later. So we can put the foil on them all, put them back in. And he's going to start the chicken, which we'll show you in a little bit. Oh. Look at there, nice. Falling apart. Wow. What are you doing now? Luke? Oh, you're, you're shredding it up? Yep, shredding it up. Is this called Hoots Chicken? Yep. Look at there, you guys. Spices, he's ready. 
Got Oops. apples in there. Apples too? Wow. Just put some chicken on top there. Yeah. You got them around here. You got some chicken going. There. Look at there, you guys. Them. So those are full chickens, huh? Yep. Well, look at that. Nice and tender, all done. Here you go. Watch this, guys. Nice. Whoa, look at that. Yeah, she looks good. Well cooked. Good job. Here's the big wedding crew at Hoots Cookout. Good turnout. Their tent. Look. Right here. Yeah. There you go to Brian and the groom. Congratulations. Anyway, Hoot, you did a good job cooking today. The food turned out excellent. Really enjoyed it. The best I ever had in Minnesota. You were right about your uh, 30 plus years of cooking experience. Nobody does it better than Hoot's Barbecue. And if you guys want, I'll put a link in the description. If you want to check him out, he might be up for sale. The price is right. He's negotiable. Thanks again, Hoot. Thank you. And are you guys watching this video, please like and share. Thanks. Good Peace, from, with that boy. Peace from uh, Blue Sharp.